Hello everyone, and today I'm going to give you some recommendations how to stay fit in quarantine. Well, the main idea of this video, besides of staying fit, is create your own schedule uh, for not wasting, wasting your time uh, unnecessarily. Well, firstly, you are going to go to your mobile play store, uh, the, the play store from Google, and you are going to uh, download the app uh, Time Tune. Uh, with this app, you will be able to create a daily schedule. So, for for instance, if you want to to do your bed, do the dishes, or clean the house, and you have to work or you have to study, you can program some tasks in order to do it. And the app will notify you and inform you the tasks that you have to do at the moment. With this app, you will have a scheme of your of your daily basis. So, so it's very uh, useful. It's very important having those apps. Well, second, you with the schedule completed, you will program a training time. I recommend you 30 minutes or one hour, five days per week. So, and along with this, program some healthy snacks between the main meals. Uh, prefer eating, I don't know, fruits, vegetables nuts, a lot of water, that is important. So, because the, the best way to optimize your metabolism is eating at least every three hours. So, the, the main meals must be healthy too, that is important. And doesn't mean that you are going to, to eat a little amount of food. No, the idea is that the, the idea is eating until you feel full. So prefer dishes with salad, vegetables, white or red meat, seafood, eggs, pota potato, beans, etc. And there are plenty of delicious food and they are, they are healthy. You don't have to starve to, to be fit, that is a myth. And avoid staying without moving long period of, of, of time. That is not so good for your body. Try to walk a little, stretch your, your limbs. It helps uh, to your metabolism. It's very useful. And finally, make an exercise routine. Train hard and try different exercises. In one day you can do cardio, other day you can work lifting weights. Try to divide the training zone of your body and, be, and try to be aware of your boundaries. That is important. You always have to start warming up. It's important warming up, warming up because you warming up, you are going to you will avoid a, pos, a possible injury. So it's very good warming up uh, before starting. And then when you start, the first days are going to be very hard, I know. But the body is going to used to do the training and will ask for more and more exercise. It's very funny. You have to come up with new routines, um, avoid making the same routine for a long period of time. Keeping the same routine will stop you in losing weight or, or gaining muscle. So try to be creative. Change your routine every two weeks so your body will be surprised with the exercise that you are having now. And along with this, try to increase the intensity of, of the training progressively. Uh, another factor, important factor, and that is very important, uh, is as important as the exercise, is resting period. You have, I mean, you have to sleep. Try to have at least eight hours of full dream is very difficult, but believe me, you will see better outcomes if you give your body a, a rest. So turn turn off your, your phone and, and sleep, it's very important. But it doesn't matter what do you do if you are not constant. So for a good or for good outcomes, you have to be constant. That is the key, it's very important. So 
those are some advices of of uh, getting a uh, getting fit in this period of quarantine lockdown and also the exercise is going to release your mind it's going to avoid some mental issues i don't know but that is goodbye thanks for watching my video